From the students of the Department of Meteorology and Atmospheric Science, here is your Penn State Campus Weather Service forecast. Good Tuesday evening, State College. I'm student meteorologist Daniel Weaver. Just think, tomorrow is Wednesday and uh, we, are, we are already halfway through the week. But bringing it back to today, it is certainly a lot warmer today than it has been for quite a while. This is a time lapse outside of Beaver Stadium throughout the day today, and we can see that temperatures have been mostly in the mid low to mid 30s, certainly a lot warmer than it has been. And if you look closely enough on the ground at the snow on the field there towards the end of the time lapse, you might be able to see some snow melt towards the end there. And that, and along with these warmer temperatures that we are expecting this week, that will definitely be the case as we go on throughout the week this week. But bringing it back to right now, we have a temperature of around 36 degrees, and it feels like 36 degrees because there is no wind, no, very little a west wind at three miles an hour, and overcast skies, which you can certainly see behind me. Here's a look at our winter weather reports from this morning, because we did have a little bit of freezing rain, but not too much. You can see some reports across the northern portion of the state freezing rain, but not really as bad as we were anticipating last night, which is certainly the good news. But your weather headlines for this week, like I said, it is definitely going to be warming up, as we, especially as we get towards the end of the week. But along with that warm-up, we are going to see an increase of clouds and crowds. And along with those crowds, there's going to be rain falling from them. So it's going to be a pretty yucky week throughout this week. But at least it will be warm. And we can see that warmth here on our five-day outlook. Wednesday and Thursday is starting to warm up, but then Friday really gets warm at around 53 degrees at least 10 to 20 degrees above average for this time of year before we start to cool down a bit on Saturday and into Sunday ahead of our next storm system. But bringing it back to today and tonight into tomorrow, we have, do have a few showers moving throughout the state throughout the day tomorrow before our next really big rain arrives tomorrow afternoon and then breaks up there over the Allegheny Mountain or Appalachian Mountains and then just a few scattered showers throughout Wednesday night and into Thursday morning before, and once again, more showers Thursday. That's really just going to be the case. But Friday, it finally starts to clear up, at least in terms of the rain. The clouds will stick around, so it's still going to be cloudy, but it's going to be clear uh, in terms of precipitation before our next storm system arrives from the southwest. And that brings us a good, good batch of rain on sun Saturday night into Sunday, with maybe a few lingering snow showers across the northern northwestern portion of the state, but that's going to be tricky because it's going to be a little too warm for really any good snow accumulation. And bringing it to next week on the 6 to 10 day temperature outlook from the Climate Prediction Center, we can see that they're thinking that they're, it's going to be pretty warm across the majority of the continental United States, which is certainly a big reversal from where we've been these past few weeks where it's just been frigid and all that Arctic air. But for tonight, we are expecting the low of 32 degrees with spotty showers and that is pretty much going to be the case tomorrow, too, with a high of 40, but yet more rain for tomorrow. And that will be it's pretty much reflected on our seven-day forecast. As we can see, the rain starts tomorrow and goes on, into, goes on into Thursday before the rain moves down on Friday and the temperatures warm up. But then once again, the temperatures go down on Saturday and the rain comes in on Saturday night and into Sunday before they level out a bit. Rain moves down on Monday and the temperatures climb up a little bit on Tuesday along with an increase of sunshine. Well, that does it for me for your evening forecast. I'm Daniel Weaver. Have a great evening.